week, Ryan and Tim and Banerjee have been working on uh, the, the, the next RV, right? And so what we're going to do today is what we do. We're going to open the curtains about that much, and we're going to, we're going to let you know a little bit a little bit about the RV-15. And I apologize that we can only open the curtain so far, but it's what's made Van's, Van's aircraft. It's why I went to work for Van. Uh, it's a conservative company. Until we fly the airplane and we're assured of the performance, I don't want to promise you a picture, and I'm sorry we won't be showing a picture today. We will be done before Oshkosh next year to the point where we can have a picture and show that. So just stay tuned. As soon as we get there, you will know about it. Um, but it will be a high wing. Uh, we've been at this for some time. You go to the next slide. It will be backcountry capable. So here's a few blackmail pictures of Van. Uh, there's a lot of commentary over the years, Van, about why high wings aren't the best choice. And anyway, uh, so this is a picture of Van at Oshkosh. Of course, you can recognize these airplanes. This happened to be an airplane that just stopped in to pick up uh, parts for, he's an RV-8 builder. He uses that as his pickup truck. And I caught Van standing by it. Uh, and of course, here we have Van looking at a glass air, glass star. So will it have baggage space? How much? How slow will it stall? We're, we don't plan on telling you how slow it will stall. We'll at first, just show you how slow it will stall. Uh, will it have floats? What size tires? Will it be cantilever struts braced? Will it be tandem or side by side? And uh, again, we'll be releasing that as soon as we can, that information. But until we get there, uh, we're excited about the design. I think it's definitely... A high wing is a, a new airplane for us. Yeah. So this is a, a large departure, and uh, I'm definitely pleased aesthetically how it's coming along. So patience, but well, we get it just right. We want this to be total performance. And what total performance means is, means is we want the control handling to be correct. And that's one of the things that could change this design. So until we get that dialed in, once we get the control handling that we want, we will release to the public uh, a picture of this airplane. So how far along is the design? Yes, they let the presidents work on it. That's me at the jigsaw. So what we're doing here is building the pine pigeon. Um, and that's a, just a mock-up. We have that done. We do the, the ergonomics of the airplane. So we're trying to figure out, you know, where should the A pillar be? Where should the B pillar be? How can you get in and out of the airplane? Uh, I can tell you the airplane will be a control stick. We're going to go there. And uh, so it's well on its way. We have not yet flown it. Once we've flown it again, we will tell you more about the airplane. The main reason we're doing this is Everybody has suspected this. We want your feedback at this point. We have what we think is a pretty mature design. The, que the question was, will it be a two-place? The answer is, I can tell you. After I fly it, and I know how the CG and the aerodynamics work out, uh, you'll know. <laughs> we, we can tell you, but we have to. At least in one place, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's not going to be a no-place. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I can't tell you can't that. Tell you. <laughs> In the back. Float mount capable? He asks, is it float mount capable? I can't. That may be, maybe. This, we'll this say information maybe. will eventually be forthcoming, and the answer will be either yes or no. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I'm doing fairly well, I think. The help is holding up pretty good, still flying, flying my glider a lot. Uh, I don't do a lot to help these guys. I got to admit that they're so far ahead of me in capability that I just, uh, I'm really in awe of what's going on and the advances that are being done. I'm perhaps more optimistic than ever about the future of the company based on what they're doing, the people they're hiring, and just the way they're um, organizing everything. Again, me personally, I'm just uh, real happy to still be involved with the company, that they still provide me a chair that I can come in and sit down when I want to. And uh, 
Yeah. So uh, that's about the best I can answer. I, uh, you know, I just hope and pray that I have a lot of good years left and can continue flying and uh, just be here year after year. Thank you.